Get business commentary on Web3 news related to NFTs, crypto, metaverse, and more. The show is streaming to you from Dubai, the global crypto capital. Welcome, I'm Ayman Aitani, your host and guide to the exciting new world of Web3.0. In this show, we have more from VCon, where the Web3 innovators and entrepreneurs rub shoulders with other enthusiasts and entrepreneurs like me. We have talked about NFTs. So how do you get involved? How do you invest? Avery Ekinani has the answers. For the large businesses who want to get into this space, and at this point you're curious, what, what do you think the steps are? The very first step should be doing research into places like Discord or YouTube videos or podcasts um, to learn first. Second step should be getting set up with their wallet and it doesn't need to be a large amount of money or an expensive NFT purchase, but genuinely go through that process that a consumer goes through when they're buying an NFT to really get it. Oftentimes that's the light bulb moment for folks when they understand the current process and then they get their first NFT in their wallet and it starts to click a little bit. And the third thing I would say is continue to do that homework, continue to go to places like Beacon and learn, hear speakers, hear creators, hear um, folks who are leading in the world of Web3, um, so you can think about how you can actually add value and incorporate um, a lot of the things that you're hearing into your own business and ecosystem. If I say conference, you would probably think of people sitting around listening to boring speakers. Oh. Well, with Beacon, it is very different. This is fun. It has the latest in technology, consumers, businesses, music, pop three, art, comic books. I hope you find something of great interest to you and you go into conferences like VCon where you feel good. It's an industry that you want to be in and it's fun to be around people uh, with a similar mindset and uh, within a fun environment. Let us talk with VFriends president Andy Cranach about intellectual property and NFTs. How would you define VFriends? VFriends is an intellectual property company uh, rooted in 283 characters uh, which are based on NFT Web3 technology. So every character is uh, an NFT which provides access and utility and community development uh, for all the people that own those NFTs. But it's also uh, rooted in these amazing characters with traits and qualities that we hope to aspire in the world. How would you define utility and the importance of important for things? NFTs create the opportunity uh, for utility because it's something that you can own on the internet, on the blockchain, and thus you are able to unlock anything you really want, whether that's a, a ticket to a mega super conference like Vicon, or whether that's a phone call with someone. Uh, that NFT provides utility by unlocking whatever you wish to provide uh, as that utility. We will have more Web3 videos in our next show. In the meantime, share this video with people in your network who are curious about Web3. I'm Ayman Aitani, and I'll leave you with some bloopers from my VCon recordings. If you want to know about the latest, Bruh. if you're trying to understand Web3, <laughs> one thing that I've observed about the community of Web3 is that they're very interested in pop culture, retro and current. So I feel there are two tiers, the 20s and the 40s. One thing that I have... If I'm still... <laughs> okay.